Hi guys and welcome. It's been a beautiful day today so I've decided to do my latest charity haul just sat in my garden. So first of all I'm going to get straight in with the items of clothing that I've got. This top is just a black, it's like a vice coat top and but if I go down the sleeve can you see the lovely ending of the sleeve there? Now this is not for me, it's for one of my daughters, but that I paid 50 pence for, 50 pence. This is another one. And this is a red, it's like red um, embroidered cotton it is. And then again, it's got cute sleeves on it. And again, I bought this for one of my daughters. I think, I think probably our Katie will end up with both of these. 50 pence again. Give away prices, really. Now, there's only one more item of clothing that I've got to show you. And I looked at this, and I picked it up yesterday when I was shopping with Jean, and I says, what do you think to this, Jean? And she was like, mmm, I'm not sure. It's very little house on the prairie. And I said, I'm thinking for our Katie because she's got some new Doc Martens. And I says, a Doc Martens with this dress is going to look so cute. It does come with a belt. Now, let me just have a look at this. Where's the tag? Oh, I don't know where the tag were. I think they originally wanted £4 for it and then it was marked down to £2.50. And I'm just going to show you that. So you can see there, it's got like a frill coming round the collar, cute sleeves which are all, which are all um, puckered and then you've got your button that fastens your cuff and then you've got like a, you know, like a gypsy type bottom. And I think that on Kate is probably going to be, it's probably going to be about three quarter in length because she is tall. But I did say to Jean, I says, worst scenario, if she doesn't like it, I says, I will just cut the top off and make it into a skirt because that's what I do. <laughs> But for £2.50, that's a great price to take a, ch to take a chance on, and that is 100% cotton. Now, I did send a picture of this on uh, WhatsApp to both my girls saying, uh, how cute is this? And I said to our Katie today, because I've just worked out with her, do you like like the Klaus on the Prairie type dresses? Could you see it? She says, I've seen it, Mum. I've seen it on there. She says, but I'm not. I says, do you know what, Katie? Vision, you dot Martins with that dress. And she went, oh. Yes, that could work. I said, it will work. So she's coming up Friday, so she'll be able to try that on then. So that's the clothes. So this is the finished look. What do you think, Tina Bambina? Now, these little... I think, I'm not sure what these would have been bought for. I don't know where they're from because I did take the tags off them. There was, you know, like the stick labels that comes off them, but it didn't say which shop they were from. Now, initially, when I saw these, I thought candles in my garden. But then when I got them home and washed them, and I thought, they're far too pretty them to go in garden. So I've got in my bathroom, I've got both of those two on my windowsill in my bathroom. One for Q-tips, one for cotton pads. Now you might think, well, that's not going to hold many cotton pads. And you're quite right. But there's eight in there. Now in my ba main bathroom, I never use it unless I'm having a bath. So I use my ensuite. But like when Katie's coming this Friday, take her makeup off. She's doing her makeup, any smudges. So they're on hand in the bathroom for it. So there doesn't need to be a lot in this for the purpose in the main bathroom but how nice and beautiful is that colour on them now I got four so when I done my makeup in, in my back bedroom I've got another one with some cotton pads on so that if I make any things with my makeup I've got them on hand to use and then in the other one I've got some q-tips I've got my glitter lipsticks I've got my mascara I've got my Lisa Armstrong eyeliner and they're just with me so I can just grab in hand 50 pence each. There was on there was on a on a shelf, no price on them. And I literally walked up to counter says to the lady says, Oh, I says, how much are these, love? I says, there's no price on them. I says there's four on them. She says, the 50 pence each, love. And I thought, at 50 pence each, I'm having them because they're just beautiful, really are pretty. Now 
Now what I've got here is, it's a ceramic oil burner and wax melt. And you can see it's only a tiny one, that's a small one. And it comes with some wax melts. But that was in the 50p basket. And I, I picked it up and I thought, I'm going to have that for my bathroom because it's, it's, it's not, it doesn't take too much room because it's quite small. So I'm going to put that on my windowsill in my bathroom. Now what I've got here then is a plant pot and then there's a gold pot inside it. And they're both from Ikea. They've both got the labels underneath. And I paid £1.75 for that because I have got a couple of plants that's in water in the kitchen that's growing roots to repot. And then what I picked up also here is two what they look like books but they're the storage boxes identical so they've got Paris on the front stand them up like books and I had lots of little um, jewellery boxes on my drawers in my bedroom just stacked up on top uh, that look quite messy really so I've put them all in this one fold it up and then I just stand it up and then the little one Again, I've just got fashion jewellery in there. I've got a perfume sample. Where else have I got? A book marker. And then just little things, again, that I just had on the side. So it's cleaned my side up lovely on my uh, drawers. And then with these two, I just literally have those two stood up in my bedroom. And then they're so, it's so handy to just grab them and take whatever I want out of them. £3 for the set. Now, the big one, and I don't know if they were bought as a set or if they had to be bought separate, but it's got 9 99 on the back of the big one. So, at £3, and they are really good condition. So, this is another item that I got. Now, it, the centrepiece, the candle holder there, wasn't included in this. That was bought from Home Base. And I bought that a few years ago. I've actually got three of those, but I thought for now I'll put it in. But I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to buy some of those. You know, like the tea lights can get the, the ones that's, I think it'll just be a little bit smaller than that, but that's almost like a two and a half inch circumference. But that, I thought, is just lovely. And I picked that up for £2. And I think in the shops, I've seen them for about £12.99. So I've saved about £11 on purchasing that. It's not going to live outside, by the way. I'm going to have it in my living room. Um, but I just thought that was so cute for the money. So let me show you the last two things. It was in a box on a shelf. And I only bought these yesterday. And when I went, the lid was off. And then you've got this hat. Which comes in a plastic thing. That... I'm thinking when I, you know, when I got to 1940s days, that that would be lovely to wear. But I thought at the time that this went on top of it somehow. But then when I looked in the box when I got home, there's a headband that comes with this one. And it just goes in there. And then you put that on. So again, this, you know, for a uh, 1940s day with my hair all done and dressed up, it's going to look lovely, isn't it? And how much did I get these for? A pound. Literally a pound. Uh, and when I've showed people, I mean, like, the set box would be worth more than a pound. So that just fits on there to keep it in shape. Now, a shopping day yesterday with me and Jean was very, very slim pickings. I think Jean only spent £1.50 and she bought a t-shirt and then she got like a, it was like an oval shaped crystal dish, which was 50 pence. And I think I got that dress. I bought those hats yesterday. And then I bought the oil burner yesterday. And that's all I got. And I says to Jean, I says, I don't think we've ever had a day where we've never bought, when we bought as little. And she, she said the same, she went, I agree. But so, but these what I have got, and they've been over the last probably three charity shopping trips that I've had. I think you'll agree that again, all great prices, aren't they? 
So let me know, guys, what you think to some of my buys. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Bye for now.